What is up everyone on YouTube? This is of course your main man Tony and I am back for another video. Um, I thought I'd switch angles a little bit because I'm always standing right there filming and I thought this angle looked really dope because I am using my window as lighting is coming through and I'm pretty sure you can see me pretty clear. Make sure you see me pretty good. Um, also got that new vineyard vines hat right here as you guys can probably see. Shout out to my man Tanner for hooking me up. But yeah, um, today I have a sneaker unboxing as you guys could probably see from the title. And I just wanted to show it to you guys and just bring it to the channel. So without further ado, let's get it. I'm not going to waste any time here. No time is needed to be wasted for this shoe unboxing. But as you guys can see, you got that Jumpman logo. Oh yeah. You guys know, if you guys, if you guys are sneakerheads, you guys know what kind of box this is. You know you got them threes and if you have me on Snapchat. You already know what I had to scoop, size 13. Um, yeah, so I will leave all my social media in the description below. So make sure you guys go check out my uh, social media pages and um, add me on Snap if you don't already have me. But yeah, you guys see the box, Snap with the box. Right up. Yeah, good pick, you hear that crumbling sound. And without further ado, we got a pair of Cyber Monday 3s in the cut. These are a very, very, very clean sneaker in my opinion, and I'm, no, these have got a lot of mixed reviews, but I'm going to give you my real good opinion of the shoe and just show you guys why this is such a great pickup. Before we start off with all of that, um, I'm going to have to shout out my man, or, you know, the same place I usually go for all my sneakers, footlocker.com for assisting me with these. Gave me a great deal, gave me a great deal, and even gave me $20 off of my whole order whole order so i only paid 145 for these because they were on sale for 149 but that wasn't without shipping so every after everything i got these for 145 78 and yeah not regretting it it's such a great pickup in my opinion and such just a clean colorway and shoe just to give you guys a little bit of history or whatever if you don't know about this shoe already these dropped in mid uh october in the middle of october they were going to be released cyber monday which is in november end of november but instead of them releasing that day, the uh, True Blue 3s released. And so they pushed this up forward for the release and ended up releasing these one month earlier. And yeah, they're called the Cyber Monday 1s. Or not Cyber Monday 1s. Cyber Monday 3s because of the Cyber Monday 1s. That feature an all black upper and that white midsole. As you guys can see on this shoe, it has the exact same color blocking all black uh, upper with a white midsole. And yeah, and outsole is just very clean. It's just a very, very nice shoe. And in all honesty, this shoe does not even need a review. It just speaks for itself. Like I've already said, everything is blacked out. The uh, logos are blacked out. That Jumpman is blacked out. That uh, Jordan Air is blacked out on the back. Um, so yeah, Nike blacked out all their brandings except on the outsole. And I don't know if you guys can see it. You have that Jordan outsole, as you guys can probably see right there. Um, I'm not going to lie. Um, they did an alright job with these shoes. Like the color blocking is amazing. I like it because it's so simple. You can wear it with everything. Like this matches with it. Like it just doesn't matter. Black matches with everything. The one thing I hate about this shoe though is, um, first thing I hate about this shoe is the craftsmanship. Like don't get me wrong, the leather is premium. As you guys can see, you got that premium leather all around the shoe. It's just the focus. It's just a very good leather quality. You guys can see it, see the wrinkles in it. So it's very quality, don't get me wrong. But the one thing I don't like about it is because you have is that you have glue stains all over the shoe. Like for example, right here on the branding or the heel tab, you have glue marks all right there. Like right there is a glue mark. There's glue marks all around the outsole and midsole, like all through here, there's glue marks. And even the black from the uh, leather has even dripped onto the midsole. Like and it gives it kind of like a cool effect in a way, but some people might not like that because you don't want black leather or black um, leather or like paint dripping onto your midsole and ruining your whole shoe. But some people might like it. I think it's all right, but yeah, there's a little bit of that on this side. I don't know if you can really see it. You probably can't, but yeah. Um, got that Jordan or that grayish um, Jumpman on the insole, and you got your sizing tag that Foot Locker usually includes in all of the shoes, size 13, as you guys can see, just to make sure you guys know I'm legit. Um, so yeah, I even so what I did was, um, I bought these, and Foot Locker really assisted me because like there's I had a lot of trouble with these trying to get these. 
These didn't come for like three or four weeks, which is when I ordered them a while back. So what Foot Locker did is they gave me a gift card and they put $20 on the gift card and gave me $20 off the shoe. So in all, I got $40 of savings, so I'm not complaining. And yeah, but Jordan brand, you guys need to step it up on the quality and the craftsmanship of your shoes. And that's probably why these shoes are marked down as the is at $149.99 on pretty much every site. That's And that's why they're not selling out is because of the craftsmanship. But other than that, I love the shoe. But I'm not going to lie, these are B grades. These are like the, the threes you would find in the outlet. Like how the Legend Blues were for $169 in the outlet. This is how these are. They're B grades. But it doesn't matter because you can't really tell because it's an all black silhouette. So it doesn't really do anything or like defeat the purpose of the shoe. But yeah, that's it for this review. The Cyber Monday 3 is on the cut or in the cut. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a little bit of B-roll for you guys. Catch you on the next video. This is Antonio from Dimboards Reviews signing off. Peace.